and welcome to Journal of the Scots. I am Scott, and I'm happy to announce, oh, Happy New Year for everybody. So again, thank you so much for joining. I have a, a great announcement. One of the things that, you know, when you're a new YouTuber and you just have a YouTuber, I just say I'm a YouTuber. I, I guess I guess I am. Uh, I do have a day job. However, um, I've been kind of, uh, you know, you start with your phone, you start with some really basics. The lighting in this room is absolutely god awful. And even the paint and everything is, uh, it, it's not really conducive for doing videos. So I have been searching and I haven't been wanting to allocate too much budget for this. So I am on a shoestring budget. I need lots of uh, help on all of this kind of stuff uh, because, you know, with two kids, in a really bad plastic habit <laughs> of acquiring new Lego sets. Sometimes it's hard to upgrade your equipment, but today I've hopefully, and it just came in the other day, is a newer, uh, I'm hoping I'm even doing this justice, but it's a two pack actually. Um, and it's a it's a, an adjustable lighting setup, so I can kind of add some extra pop. It's a 4600, um, style or uh, LED. I should probably read this, right? So yeah, it doesn't say on the outside. So, but it's definitely, it was on sale on Amazon. So we got a deal. I think it was almost 50% off. Um, I think it was just, just under $50 when it normally, this goes for uh, over $80. A lot of the other kits or sets Usually the lighting can cost you anywhere from about 100 to 150 for a really, really nice setup, unless you go very straight on and you have like light coming down. But here, everything's indirect and it's in the, the paint. I probably will have to repaint this room at some point. <laughs> um, so with that, I just wanted to unbox and kind of show this off. I will then... Um, try to set it up although it's going to take some time to kind of figure out optimal angles so i probably won't get all of it in this video but i will put a link below um, for it so as i unbox it here this is what we get these are probably some of the filters there we go and it's a two pack so i i was really amazed at how small this came like i think literally it was like another box right in it it came and i was like whoa that must be how they keep the cost down so here's one light right here whoops probably shouldn't be banging these around um there we go so it comes with a, a filter right in it I'll have to read the instructions. Um, but there's a, oh, there's an up, down, and an on and off switch, and it's USB. So I'll, I have a strip with extra USB available, so this will work out great. Uh, and then here's your a second one here. There we go. So it's the manual of LED light for live show. And it shows packing accessories, the basics on how to use it. There we go. Mm, okay. It says you can contact us this way if you have any issues, warranty repair. And here are the two stands, just like so. So it was packed pretty nice, very efficient. There we go. And then some gel. Throw that away. There it goes. Awesome. Let's see if we can get one of these standing, since I should be able to put together Lego and use instructions. Here we go. Packing accessories. So there's an A, which is the big one. Right here. Let's 
that. Okay. Well, it's just a nice little stand there. The bottom. That's interesting. So it's meant to be a little bit more, more uh, wide. This is pretty light setup. So I don't think it puts a lot of downward pressure on this. So, oh, this one. Okay. Um, oh, this will get you so you can position it. So this tightens it, and then you can rotate it one way or the other. So let's just assume for right now, straight up and down. Then go this is the bottom here. You can use this as a handle or you can put it on the tripod base like so. Let's get a decent amount of height right out of the gate, which is good. All right, so I guess this is kind of meant to be dabbling. Okay. Oh, down key, reduce the brightness up to increase brightness up to 100%. Very cool. So let's use um, let's use this one. And now, I mean, this is a good. I I kind of have the. You definitely see a shadow behind me. I have just a regular like $5 target lamp blazing down on me. Um, biggest thing is, is this cord going to be long? Looks like it's going to be decent. So there we go. All right, and then this will go up on here. Like so. Okay, so next time. Don't untangle first. All right, so I'm doing it so it's snug. I'm going to take this around, and then I can loosen or tighten. Let's go like that. Um, it says turn right. 
push upward to close. Oh, so now it's kind of locked in. There we go. Look how high we can get. So that's not bad. We'll take that. And we can kind of... There we go. Tighten it up. There we go. So there it is. Now we just got to plug her in. I wonder if I have... If this will reach, probably not from here. What I'll do, I'm going to put this right behind. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Let's see. There's definitely still some shadowing going on. Dang, that's bright. Hopefully I'm not like super washed out. Um, I probably need a little bit more angle. Yeah, I'm still getting um, shadowing. I'm wondering if I turn this off. What does that look like? Oh, there's no shadow. Shadow. So now the shadow is here, which makes sense. So I almost need like uh, another one. Hmm. This one right here, which we'll have to put together. I'm gonna have to do some playing around with the shadowing. A little shadowing is not a bad. I it just well, like when you get like a whole person, and I'm looking at the videos. It's a little. It's just something I've been wanting to upgrade for a while. And uh, the the quality of the camera is decent. I, I don't really have a camera. I'm just using, so for those who don't know, I'm just using a standard, like a Microsoft Surface, which presents some challenges, but it's also very easy on one hand, too. It's just click and go. Um, I have it tied to a OneDrive, which then I, I can upload, I, or I, can, I edit, upload, and then I uh, put it into a hard drive for safekeeping later. So it's a pretty easy setup that I've got going on. Um, really nice. I've got it just kind of like rigged <laughs> from a camera standpoint. Um, the lighting again has been like super challenging, super duper challenging. And I'm really pumped. I'm not going to make the mistake this time. Um, let's see. I'm trying to remember. This goes here. Like that. So the question is, do I have another? Oh, you know what? I can power it off the laptop. This one. It's pretty crazy. Pretty crazy that I'm going to have a full full setup. Super pumped. Um, you know what? I'm going to be smart this time. Let's go. Uh, let's tighten that so it's straight. And then... There we go. Okay, so now this one's ready to go. I'm going to see what happens if I try powering it off the left. Okay, I'm back. I've got the, the lights set up, and hopefully there's just minimal shadowing behind me. 
I don't have a full three point setup now. It's kind of like a two and a half. <laughs> uh, and of course, and if there was uh, um, better lighting down above me and the the paint was a lot better, I think it wouldn't be quite as dark. But man, if I clean this area up, the lighting is so much better. I'm really excited about that. So I'm going to be able to kind of have this set up wherever I go. So definitely just from the outset again i haven't actually seen the video yet but i'm just kind of feeling pounded by light it's really getting me excited about 2022 and the new lighting that is journal of the scots so thanks for watching again i'll send the uh, the link watch for deals right now i think it the price you know right at the end of the year after these deals kind of shot up it probably started running low in stock um i was seeing just some i checked through the reviews and all of them in fact uh man i should do a review of the reviews like why not while i'm here um let's see here so there we go um not this one here it is so right now it's 70 bucks 69.99 i'm pretty sure that i got this thing for like 42 45 dollars at the i think yeah i think it was like 45 dollars and i was like holy crap so it was it's normally msrp 83.99 i'm pretty sure it was like 40 percent off and I was able to get it for like $45, $46. So I, I hit the buy button. Boom. And uh, it's again, it's newer two pack dimmable 46K USB LED video for streaming. And I'm really ecstatic about it. Here it is on, oh, well, this is newer.com. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Amazon. Shopping. Newer, newer, newer. Oh, B B and H has it for forty. Hold on. Newer. Amazon newer. Fifty six hundred. Huh. Well, Walmart's got these things for 41. Dang. Newer. Six hundred video lights two pack. Oh, forty four ninety nine. Okay, free delivery. Number one bestseller, fifteen thousand reviews. So Walmart does have them for less right now, forty one dollars. Um doesn't show the msrp on this particular one but i know it was showing before like yeah that i purchased it basically on christmas <laughs> got it before the new year that's how popular these things are bunch of video reviews wow Here we go. Plenty bright enough for small projects. These newer video lights are just what I needed for conference calls. Lights me up with 50% intensity. They stand nearly eye level. Great value for streaming. Inexpensive small works, but fragile. So because of COVID, I needed to have a lot of video presentations. I don't have a room even for a TV in my house, so I use these. Just what I needed. I used to 
use photography lights for traditional bulbs and they get super hot these leds for under 40 dollars take my money great uses for photography and videography usb is a convenience so if you're somewhere without power and you have a usb battery prick you can light them up uh, i was happy to buy more these are dirt cheap with bang for your dollar inexpensive but valuable good product does what it says and worth the money huh yeah it's just a lot of people like looking to just make videos like me boom hey and i'm not like professional so everybody's like this is like four four stars and above right there are some cheaper options out there, but it gets even more fragile and crazy looking. <laughs> so I feel like this is a good purchase. Some of the more professional ones get up to the two, three hundred dollar range for kits, or you can get like the Elgato, you know, key light, which I think is about 150, somewhere in that ballpark. So it's like you can definitely spend on lights. I want to make sure that I'm well lit. This area just sucks for lighting. Um, again, I think I've mentioned that three times. So now I'm well lit. So wherever I go, I can kind of just point these. I've got my ring light. I've got everything I need. So that way, Microfighter Monday, my reviews, my mock building series, my hauls, everything's going to look great come the new year. So thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you on the next well-lit video.